What is up, everybody? Welcome to episode one of Sekiro Shadows Die Twice. Uh, so, I want to give a quick little tidbit of stuff here. I have played this game before. I've only played maybe the first 10 to 20 minutes, if that. Um, yeah, about maybe 10, 20, maybe 30 minutes. So I do know a little bit. Um, I also know that I had a lot of trouble getting past a single mid-boss. So you guys get to see me go through that. Uh, <laughs> um, the the la last two notes here. One, I don't know if I'll finish this series 100%. Um, but I may, like, continuously come back to it. It all kind of depends on how I'm feeling that day about the game. Or if, um... It, depending on how the series is going. Uh, the last piece is, you might notice in my Pokemon videos, I restrain myself from cursing or making inappropriate jokes of any kind. Uh, mainly because Pokemon most of the time has a target audience for kids, and uh, I'm just trying to cover some bases. Especially right now while I'm just trying to make a name for myself out. But... For now, let's go ahead and just get started. Um, you may notice that this this is going to be maybe a little, quality-wise, a little lower than what you might have seen if you've played this on a PlayStation 4 or on your PC. Uh, I'm playing this on my laptop, and when OBS Studio itself is not running... The game runs beautifully, high quality, everything. Oh, yes. But as soon as I try to, as soon as I open OBS at high quality, it likes chugging. And then when I start recording, it's unplayable. But when it's chugging, it, it still looks really, really bad. <laughs> so that's all I can really say. Uh, <laughs> So, right now, I think I have it set at, like, 720p, uh, so I can actually record this. If, if you don't, if you can't really see the difference, then, cool! Hopefully this is alright, uh, in the future I'm hoping to get a better setup where I'm working off of a PC instead of my laptop that can be hooked up to, like, three different monitors in a single room and run what I need to run without too much of a problem. Oh, that's graphic. That, that's nice and graphic. The exact reason why in this one we are 100% going uh, The reason why we're going 100% on, uh... Shit. <laughs> Something messed up and I lost track of what I was saying. Ooh. That's rude. What, why would you do that? You a big man. You fearless child. Does that not hurt? Curiosity. Young Cub was taken from the battlefield. He trained relentlessly indeed. Went on to become a Master Shinobi. Master Shinobi! Never forget the Shinobi Cub. Look how big that hand is! I'm guessing that Wolf here is like a full-grown man. And his master there is like... Huge. Alright, time to defend some boy, I'm sure. Huh. <sighs> 
little idol or statue. Oh, there's a coup. The Ashina clan coup. Oh, the Ashina clan was on the brink of collapse. Shinobi Nomi's wolf had lost everything. Both the man who took him in and the boy he had sworn to protect. Well, don't that suck. Like, legit. Here's a good warning. I'm pretty bad at this game. If you couldn't guess from my earlier statement about not being able to get past, like, the first real mid-boss, that's, you know, uh, I, I guess he's still part of the tutorial a little bit, but... Uh, you, you learn from these Shinobi first group and I can get past them including like the guy who has to be hit twice in a certain way but the next person you run into that uh, that does that same thing I have to I have to do it in a weird way and it's just a mess for me look at him What happened to the side of his face right there? That looks like some magical stuff. Oh well. Finally getting this recorded. So far things look good. I'm comparatively anyway. Alright, a letter thrown into a well. Kuro's... Kuro's wolf. Your destiny awaits you at the Moonview Tower. Escape from the well and find the tower bathed in moonlight. Even without a blade, you can reach it. Stay silent, stay vigilant. Sounds good. I need to remember I'm on an Xbox controller and not a Switch controller. So my A and B are in, are in separate paths. So I just played the tutorial a little bit, so I'm going to be trying to blaze past it a little bit here. <laughs> uh, maybe not blaze past it, but, you know. Basically, I know what's going on. Advance without being seen. Yeah. Uh, that way we can kind of get past the tutorial, we can actually look at cutscenes and maybe get a little further this episode than I might think. Because I am going to try and keep these episodes fairly short. He spotted me. Well, he, he spotted me. There, there's a guy above me. Uh, he talks about how where I need to go, and I need to go this direction because they're doing something to the kid here. And I forget exactly what. Oh. Okay, I didn't know he saw me. Well, ten minutes in, and I died. So, this first episode might just go on a tad bit longer than where I want it to be. I'm trying to cap out at like 30 minutes. This might go to about 35 at most, especially with me dying there. Though I am moving a little faster than I was last time, so we'll we'll let's we'll see. Maybe I just actually need to move slowly. Not actually make a lot of noise. Hmm. 
Yep, under floorboards, under the floor. There we go. First try, first try. See, yeah, they, they talk about um, the divine air being in the tower. Imprisoning a mere child, yep. So I gotta set him free. Okay, let's just continue forward. I don't really have to read too much this time around for the controls. I remember them now, even though it feels very foreign to me. Down in the grass. We gotta be very sneaky, sneaky, sir. Sneaky, sneaky. Eavesdrop. And this is gonna literally. They literally told me where it is. It's like there's a f there's a hole in the wall, but it's on the edge of a cliff. We don't have to worry about that. Which is silly. <laughs> is that not dangerous for the child? The divine air. There we go. So we go. Whoop. And I go up. And up. Just like that, I'm in. Another cutscene. <gasps> I don't know if my standards are low or what, but to me, this game still looks amazing. And I'm not talking about, like, the models or anything, but, like, just in general, everything looks really nice. There's some clipping. Okay. <laughs> That's okay. Raise my head. I get a sword. Kusabi Maru. Now, tell me my mission. In accordance with the bond of Lord and Retainer, you will pledge your life in my service. Sure. I'm okay with this. As you command. Damn. Sounds good. Now, you're going to give me something. Yeah, something is... Yeah. Sounds good. Sorry, I'm skipping through this. So, secret passage. So, I need to... So, I'm going to go ahead. We're going to get all the way to that secret passage. And depending what happens is when we'll... Is when we might call it. But let's not worry about that for now. We're going to connect both of those. And. Open. The door. It's time. Yep. Okay, so they're fairly easy. It's when I hit this guy up here. Then I need to start actually paying attention a bit more. Yep, I got... I, I, I have to work on my deflection. Oh, I just died. Oh. Oh, I didn't use the healy thing. Okay. Really? Oh, 
<laughs> Combo. Oh, never mind. Yeah, slice and dice through them. It's fine. Okay, here we go. There we are. Yep, I just locked on. Here we go. Yep. Hi. Come at me, bro. Oh boy. I didn't mean like that. Back, back. Back, back, back. <laughs> I'll say I understand I have a healing gourd, but that isn't going to help me in this exact circumstance because now I have to beat up this guy. Yep, I, I fully understand. Oh, back, back. Here we go. Back. Oh, this might take me a couple tries again. Yep. It's gonna take a couple blows, it's okay. Oh, there I went. Oh, and I have to battle through all those enemies again. This game hurts my left finger. Because I'm on the left trigger so much. Or left bumper so much. Okay. I just need to deflect this guy correctly. Hold steady. Hold steady. There we go. Patience. We'll just run down the center of him, it's fine. at me. Okay, I need to not hack and slash. Move, move! There we go. Let's just keep running through it. Even though I'm in the same position I was before now. Move backward, bud. Back 
away, back away, back away. We're gonna do it again. Come on. Oh, come on. Oh my god, I'm gonna die again. <sighs> yep. Oh, you gotta be joking. Well, frustration's gonna set in pretty fast, ain't it? Okay, let's just... Oops. Take care of them first. Come on. Go away. Come on. You. There. Maybe I'll have a bit of a better chance now. Alright, move. That didn't work. I'm gonna move again. Yep. Oh my god, I'm not used to having to attack with the right trigger. I'm over here hitting B over and over again. Same enemies again. Dad. You. -hoo. Well, hi, how's it going? Okay, boss, this this guy again. I have gotten past this guy before. In fact, I got past him earlier today. Oh, 
come on. Come on. Come on. You can do this. Move forward. go <sighs> yep I got I got medicinal pellets of some kind <sighs> the very least we got past that part uh, this door is very much locked so I need to go this way Fistful of ash. Um, it's okay. My health is all right. Um, was there anything down here? Nope. Okay. Okay. Let's just go. supposed to walk wall crawl or whatever hug it supposed to hug it okay eavesdrop on these guys secret yeah there's a secret passage down here uh we have orders to guard it security's really tired we'll be pawns very soon and then there's this creepy thing right here that could in fact kill me here we go again are you kidding me oh my gosh if I have to start from the beginning Oh, please don't tell me I have to start from the beginning and fight that thing. This stupid boss again. Oh, thank you. Okay. I killed that thing first try last time. What the heck? It was luck. Pure luck. At least we don't have to listen to those guys again. say that a lot. I'm also playing this on like a smaller like windowed screen instead to make the recording work. Hey, pellets. Uh, is there anything there? No. Let's just jump without looking. It's fine. I'm gonna go this way real quick. Or I can't. Maybe I'm just... I can't do anything on this. Okay. Let's go. Yeah. <sighs> and we got the child once more. Why do you not wear shoes? Do you not have shoes? Or those, like, sandal things? Or... Oh, 
Mm. Excuse me. Yes, we must go. This is the only way to run from the faded bloodline. Okay. Okay, well, with that, we'll call this episode one. Because uh, I think the next step is pretty... Wait, you know... No. I know what happens up next. It'll only be an extra, like, five-ish minutes, I think. Because uh, last time I... I did this thing. Uh, it didn't last long. Not at all. See the guy in the distance? I can be that guy. So here we go. Are you, you going to talk to me with big bow? The divine heir. Last we stood together was your uncle's funeral. His armor and helmet are so cool, Lord Genichiro. Oh my gosh, is he? I guess he's samurai. Maybe. I don't know if he's considered samurai or just a soldier. Oh, I know how this fight's gonna play out. But look at this shot. Uh, so the no little shinobi stands in our way. I feel like uh, real life ninja were actually fairly noble, like they're saying here. I'm doing better than last time. Oh! Hey, look, I actually got some damage on him. Too many stuck shooting a stupid bow and arrow. That was in a terrible condition. I only get some damage on this guy. Wow, yeah, I'm doing a lot better this time around. Oh, okay. There it is. Mm. Ouch. I still, I still love his entire look here, uh, General Shin General Jinichi Ro, I believe is what his name is. I still love everything about it, even the giant bow. I feel, I feel fulfilled from that fight personally. <laughs> Uh, that's a new record for me. I think I've I've fought this guy now three times because my first playthrough, the second one earlier today when I was trying, and then this third time, and I I don't know any of his moves, but it, I, <laughs> I'm okay with it. And then the sculptor man. This mat placed over him looks super uncomfortable. It might be the CG, but it also might be the mat itself just looks uncomfortable. This arm. Though, I, could you imagine if prosthetics were basically like this? It was like, hey, look, it's your regular arm. But, uh, better, in a way. Can't say fully better, because, I mean, you, you might not have, like, full-on control. It doesn't have the same feel. Uh, death is not my fate, no, no. 
but this is where we're going to go ahead and call it. Uh, I think this is a really good stopping point because the next episode, then it will have some more time to see if I can beat this next true mid boss coming up. Uh, but thank you guys for watching and going through the slight frustrations with me. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye bye.